Hey everyone, welcome back to another massive, massive update we have for Counter-Strike. And this one is fresh out of the oven, so smash that like button, it really helps me out a lot. As today we're going to be looking at some map changes that we saw yesterday, what specifically has changed. And also, today came a really hot patch note that actually changes a lot of things for Counter-Strike. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. In today's Counter-Strike update, Tor CS actually made a new post. They made changes to the Premier matchmaking, and this is a good change. It was a pain in the ass to play promotion relegation match at every X999, which made you couldn't rank up, right? But now they changed that, and when your rating is 5,000, 10,000, 150,000, 20,000, 25,000, and 30,000, that match will be a relegation match. When your rating is 499, 999, and you get the idea um, up to 29,999, that match will be a promotion match. So relegation match and a promotion match will decide your key factors on how it will be changing. Still no mention of five stack, at least matches now will be a smaller rating difference. Um, obviously people have been waiting for a five stack for quite some time. Also, Brandon Quan said, this is a stupid question because now they're separated, but just want some confirmation. Is this matchmaking part about smaller rating differences at expense of queue times for normal matchmaking or just Premier or both? People are confused if this is going to take longer queue times, depending on the play of the game. They confuse me too with their subheading of matchmaking. I think it's for Premier. I don't think we call matchmaking ranks rating. So that was Torsia's response which wouldn't really take that long time because we if we would have like waiting matches for either a promotion match or relegation match this would obviously take a much much longer time for all of these queues as they would potentially make you wait for all other players who also can have a promotion or a relegation match but who knows i don't think it's really correlated and i think people should calm down and it's not really that now we also have matches will be now made with small rating differences between the teams at the expense of longer queue times. So it does seem like that the longer queue times are going to be happening. And personally, this is a double edged sword. People will have to wait a bit longer for their matches. So this is for matchmaking. But the Premier changed this and it's a pretty awesome idea. Instead of being stuck in an ELO hell, it actually does give you some advantages. Increased possible CS rating win-loss amount to move players faster after calibration. And you can also see a string of code here, which is pretty awesome. But what we also saw for some changes was um, a very, very quick update on the maps. So there's a Mirage changes to Wooden Ladder and the area outside the palace. And Vertigo changed to Traffic Barrels on B platform. Now, I know this might be hard to look at, but it actually does show you what has changed. Um, Tor CS has actually made an indication of what exactly is changing by the things that aren't really black. So those were the changes made by Valve developers for the game itself. We also saw a small community voting map change. So potentially we will be voting on community CS maps, but I didn't want to include that yet because I thought it was such a small change and we're going to be getting more changes in the future. If you guys want more content like this, smash that like button and I'll keep you guys updated with more news.